Hey guys, in this video we're going to set up the pipeline for our agency sub account. Right now we're under our agency sub account, we're in the opportunities tab, and then we're going to click on pipelines. And then we're going to hit create new pipeline. So first we're just going to name the pipeline, let's just name it business pipeline, but you can name it whatever your business name is. And then right here we'll put different stages that we want our clients to progress through from like new lead all the way until they're a paying client. So for the first stage I just like to do new lead. For the next stage we can do responded lead meaning somebody that's responded to one of our forms of contact, whether it's text, email, phone call, one of those. And then for the next stage, we can do appointment booked. And this would be people that either have booked an appointment themselves on our calendar or we've booked it for them on our calendar. And then we can do another stage that says like follow up drip. This would be people that didn't buy right away on our first sales call. And so we wanna keep following up to them. So eventually they will buy. And then our final stage would just be like paying client, somebody who actually signed up and became a paying client. So now that we have all of our pipeline stages set up, we're just gonna save this. And then you'll see that it was created here under pipelines. Then we go back to opportunities. And now you can see the different stages of our pipeline. And when you start getting contacts into the system here, you will see which stage they're in of the process. And then you can connect different automations so that people move automatically based on certain actions that they've taken and certain goals that they've accomplished within our system. We'll go over the automations in a later video. Your pipeline could be very different than mine just depending on like the services and the products that you offer. That's just the basic pipeline that I use for my business. And so take that one and use that one if you'd like or you can set up your own custom pipeline.